Our goal was to bring even more clarity to the design of the software while retaining the Mac's powerful capability and ease of use. We started with the simplest of elements, from the shape of a corner radius to refinements and buttons and controls. And we brought our unified language of symbols to the Mac, making them more consistent and easier to recognize. Depth, shading, and translucency are used to create hierarchy. These new materials are rich and they're vibrant. They bridge light and dark. We've reduced visual complexity to keep the focus on users' content. Buttons and controls appear when you need them, and they recede when you don't. There's a new way to access system-level controls and a unified space for notifications and widgets. We've also created a new suite of sounds that are familiar to the Mac, but remastered and more refined. We wanted consistency throughout the ecosystem so users can move fluidly between their Apple devices. But we also love that Mac icons have a deep history and a distinct look and feel. So we retain many of the highly crafted details and the playful elements that make Mac icons unique. This OS reflects an important history. It's familiar, but it's also entirely new in every detail. We love the Mac. It's the tool we use to make all the products that we put out into the world. And Mac OS Big Sur is where it starts. Hope you guys enjoyed the video on Mac OS Big Sur. I'm super excited for this. If you want me to make an actual review, hands-on review with Mac OS Big Sur, just comment down below. But other than that, guys, if you could, please like the video and subscribe with post notifications turned on. Have a great day.